cute. It's squish meal time. It's squish meal time. Oh, I'm sorry. Say hi. Hi. I don't see Ruby very often. Oh, here's my big boy. This is Ashley and welcome back to my channel. I have some squish mail for you guys, but it is not cats. <laughs> After all this time, um, I've had a lot of cat squish mellows. I just did an old cat squish mellow mail time, so make sure you check out that video. There's a lot of really good ones in that one, exclusive ones and hard to find ones. So, all right, so today I have some squish mail for you guys from a couple of retail places that you can find squish mail, um, Claire's and Cracker Barrel like the two C's, the Claire's and the Yield Barrel Crackers, as I call it. Ruby's going to go through all my stuff again. He likes to sniff bags. No, you can't get, that one's too tiny. You can't get in it, go away. Oh my goodness. Quit sniffing my Squishmallows. Ways. So we're gonna open some Claire's Squishmallow Mail and some Cracker Barrel Squishmallow Mail. Let's do the Cracker Barrel ones first because I've actually already opened them just to double check what they were. Um, I ordered these um, online for Cracker Barrel after I saw them on Squish Alert, so it's an app. So actually at Cracker Barrel, I ordered these online because I have the Squish Alert app. I'm not sponsored by them at all, but it is a good little app to have where you can choose like certain retailers to give you alerts when they restock. And Cracker Barrel is one of them. Um, we have a Crackle, ba crackle, crackle Barrel. We have a Cracker Barrel here in town, um, but they haven't started carrying Squishmallows until recently, and I already ordered these two um, before my Cracker Barrel actually got them, so I actually have seen them in store now. I could have bought them in store. They are sold out at this point in store, but I went ahead and ordered um, some of them online because I didn't know that my store had them until recently, so... Anyway, long story, let's go ahead and open the Cracker Barrel Squishy Mallows I've got. Here's the first one. <laughs> Look at this tiny flamingo. I love her. She has a little flower on her head. I love the Squish Mallows with eyelashes. I love that she has little tufts of fur for like her wings and stuff. And she is not the scented one, but the next one I'm going to show you is a scented one. So that's pretty cool. But she has a little flower on her head. Her name is Cookie. <laughs> Cookie the Flamingo. She's so cute. Here's her little squad. So all of these are available at Cracker Barrel. They have like little flowers in their head. I have a big Lena that I'm actually trying to sell on my Mercari. So if you want a big Lena, I have one from Target. Um, but the little five inch one is actually cuter. And maybe if I would have got a five inch Lena, I would have kept her. But anyways, I have Cookie and then I'm going to show you the pineapple here in a minute. So Cookie has been fascinated by flora and fauna ever since she's been able to walk. She aspires to become a botanist someday to teach others all about plants. I love flamingos. I like looking at the flamingos at the zoo and stuff like that. So she's super cute. I thought she was adorable. She could sit out for like summer stuff, like summery beachy vibes, I think. So I think Cookie's cute. She is a little five inch. Yep, she's a little five inch. Now the next one that I got from Cracker Barrel is the pineapple. And I don't remember seeing this in the store, but she's actually pineapple scented and she smells so good. My husband and I have been on a pineapple kick. I'm sorry, close your ears. But my husband and I have been on a pineapple kick where we've been eating like a pineapple a week and like grilling it and putting it on our burgers and with our shrimp and all kinds of stuff. So, but anyways, I love pineapple, <laughs> but she is so cute. There are like bigger pineapple ones, um, but I don't know. I like the tiny ones better. I'm kind of getting obsessed with the tiny Squishmallows. So I love her little bow and I love that her little fringe thing, like her actual leaves is like holographic. Oh, she's so cute. And she smells just like pineapple. It smells so good. All right. So there's her tag. We are scented. Her name is Lulu. There's the inside. Meet Lulu the pineapple. Her favorite season is summer. Huh, wonder why. Lulu loves summer cookouts, beach picnics, and going on camping trips. Where should Lulu camp this summer? Hmm, you can actually camp in our yard. Our yard is big enough. We are, we're like on two acres in the woods. So you can actually camp in our yard. Pretty, pretty fun. So I think she's super cute. I love this tiny pineapple. Oh, they're so cute together. I love them. 
I kind of want the five inch Lena now. Ugh, but they're so cute. I love them. So those are the two that I got from Cracker Barrel. I love that the pineapple is scented. That is amazing. I've never seen any other scented squishmallows. Okay, the next ones are from Claire's. And I know what's in one of them. Um, because I ordered, okay, 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 I don't know. This has Squishville in it, so I think this is the one that, I don't know, I don't know. Let me just, let me just start over. Okay, <laughs> so Claire's has, um, where you can get their, you know, their five inch or their eight inch, like assorted, but you can only pick which one you actually want to get if you go in store. So if you order online, then they're going to just give you random. You could get multiples, whatever, of the squish. So I can't remember exactly which ones I've gotten here. Um, but we're going to open and look. Um, but like I've said many times before, because I'm irritated about it. Like Claire's, Barnes & Noble, Hot Topic, y'all need to come back to my town. Because... <laughs> It's very sad that a tornado took out our mall and they're not planning on rebuilding anywhere in our town. So it makes me sad. But here we go. Claire's. This has the Squishville in it. Okay. Oh, yeah. These are the two that I picked out. Okay. So I have some Squishville. Should I go ahead and open these now? Yeah. Let's go ahead. Have you guys seen the Squishville videos on YouTube? They have a channel and they're stinking adorable. I love them. I watch them. They come out every Saturday. So they're just like little Squishvilles doing fun things. So here is a Squishville. Let's hope it's somebody I don't already have. <gasps> it is somebody new. Oh, it's a tiny Charlotte. I don't have, is it Charlotte? I think it is, but it's a tiny little cat with a little bandana. I don't have this one yet. She kind of has a weird shaped head because of her ears. But oh my goodness, she's so cute. Oh, I love her. I love the tiny cats. She's going to go with my other tiny white and colorful cats right there. Oh, so cute. I love it. Okay, I have one more Squishville. I bought two because Squishville are actually expensive. <laughs> like, I get that they come with a fashion, um, but these little things are $9. Rubius, are you going to start that again? He loves digging through paper and stuff, and I have a bunch of bags and paper over here. All right, here is a purple Squishville. <laughs> Rat. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Somebody new! Newt just moved my ring light. What are you doing, bud? All right. Oh, my goodness. And it's a Raina. It's a tiny Raina. I've always wanted a Raina, so now I've got one. She's wearing a cute little yellow skirt that doesn't exactly fit on her very well because of her wings. I'll probably end up taking the fashion off of most of these anyway because I just like how tiny they are. Oh my goodness. We need to sing the tiny and cute song. Ready? So tiny and cute. So tiny, tiny, tiny and cute, cute, cute. boop a doop boop a doop boop a doop boo. Oh my goodness. I love her. She's so cute. She's going to go with my, um, my little bugs right here. Oh, oh, so tiny. All right, the next two things from Claire's, um, I got because according to the Squish Alert, um, they have new like ex Claire's exclusive Squish, um, and I got <laughs> I got the birthday cat one because it was my birthday like before right before my birthday when I ordered these. I didn't get them until after my birthday, but oh my goodness, it's like a tie dye cat with a cake and a candle and a party hat. <laughs> it's so cute I love it and it's so like it's like so tall I don't know I've never had any that are like that round squishmallows are usually a little bit more I don't know you know what I mean <laughs> all right here is the cat's tag oh so cute her name is Cece <laughs> I love her little face today is a very special day can you guess why the party hat might give you a clue today is Cece's birthday this cuddly cat can't wait to celebrate. Will you join her special? Will you join her special day? Yes, I will, Cece. I wish it said your squish date on here, cause that'd be cute if you had like a similar birthday. But I love her. I think she'd be cute to like sit out for birthday decorations or whatever if it's our birthday week. So I love her. And then of course the one that I actually intended to get <laughs> was the Claire's exclusive purple cat. It reminds me of Chloe from Secret Life of Pets. I love her. 
because she's so fat and all over. Her little lines up here are a little strange to me. They look like forehead wrinkles. But I think she's super cute. I love the little eyes. I love eyes with eyelashes. And I love that she has like a tail that's attached here and it's big and puffy. So I think she's cute. Her name is Jingles. Okay. <laughs> Jingles wants to be a costume designer when they grow up. It's about the tassels, feathers, and glitter that make movies so magical. Last year, Jingles helped with the costumes for the school play and can't wait to do it again. All right, I apologize, Jingles. So she's going by they pronouns, or going by they pronouns. So I apologize on that. But Jingles, you are super cute. I love Jingles. <laughs> cute. I love it. All right, the next two things that I got. This is the mystery one. This is why I was like so confused in the beginning because I wasn't sure, but these are the ones that were kind of picked for me. All right, so let's see what I got in here. It's a mystery for me because I don't know. It is the dinosaur ones. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Yep. It is the dinosaur ones I ordered. Mm. Okay. I'm so excited because I have a few of the dinosaurs down here. I have Chewy and I have Edmund. <laughs> And um, I really wanted the Triceratops that I can't pronounce his name. And I got one in my mystery. Oh my goodness. I love him. I love him. I love him. I love dinosaurs so much. And I, I love the five inch dinosaurs. Like Chewie's really cute because he's a T-Rex. But I love these tiny five inch dinosaurs. <laughs> and I can't pronounce his name correctly. If you can give me the pronunciation, please. But Rio. Rocio? 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 I'm so sorry. I don't know how to pronounce it. But here's the whole squad. So as you can see, there is a Chewie in there. I really want this dragon so bad. So let's hope that dragon's in there. Um, and Edmund's a part of it, so I may get another Edmund. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Have you ever met a Triceratops who can speak seven different languages? When she was a mini Mallow, Rocio's? I'm assuming it's Rocio. Rocio's family moved Rocio's family moved a lot, so she learned a new language for every new home. Now she loves to help others learn them, too. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, my goodness. You're so cute. You're perfect for my dinosaurs down here. There you go. All right. Okay, I ordered three, apparently. Okay, here we go. <gasps> I got the dragon. Oh, my goodness. I think I already have this one and a big one. I do. It's Keith. Okay. I thought it was Keith. I have a big Keith down here. Oh my goodness. Oh, I got a little Keith. Oh, I love him. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, he's so cute. So cute. I love him. Oh my goodness. I don't know. I kind of, now I'm like, do I want to keep like my eight inch Keith back here? I don't know. Oh, I love him. I'm obsessed with the dragons. I have like a whole dragon section down here. I don't know if you can see them, but okay. Here's Keith. Oh, he's so cute. I love the dragons. <laughs> okay. Put your goggles on and grab a tool belt. It's time to step into Keith's, Keith's wood shop. Keith is a carpenter who builds cozy outdoor furniture. He also teaches a woodworking class. This week, has stu this week his students are helping build a deck. Are you signed up? He's so cute. <laughs> I'm going to have to make room for him. He's going to, like, cover up little dragons down there. Okay. Last one. Let's feel it. Oh, I have an Edmund. <laughs> I have another Edmund. Oh, my goodness. Okay. That's all right. I got two that I wanted. I've already got an Edmund. I got this Edmund from Playtime Toys, and I probably um, paid about the same price for him. So, all right. So, I have a second Edmund. <laughs> He's so cute. I do love Edmund. I like his, like, he's a pterodactyl. Um, I like his brown pattern. Though he can easily fly down the mountain, Edmund loves to show off his crunchy moves and feel the fresh snow under his, his board. This is one pterodactyl who loves cruising down the slopes. So I have twin Edmunds. Hmm. Interesting. I don't need two Edmunds, so one possibly will probably go to my nephew. If not... I'll probably sell one on Mercari because now I have a double for not 
too much over retail I'm hoping so make sure you check out my link tree down below and go to my Mercari to see the Squishmallows that I do have for sale because I have other ones as well that I'm trying to go through and purge my collection so but yay I got another Edmund I love it I do love all these so I don't know I'm really obsessed with this pineapple from Cracker Barrel because she smells like pineapple and I love her so much like I want to keep her in a bag so I can like preserve that smell <laughs> I love squishies. Um, squishies is like what got me started into a lot of YouTube stuff. And squishies are almost always scented, so I love that about them. But I also do love um, little jingles. I love jingles here. Uh, and then I like the little squishmallows in my teeth. Oh my goodness. I don't know who's my favorite. And I love Rocio, I think, is the hazier. All right, what did you guys think about that mystery of the dinosaurs? That was pretty cool that I got dinosaurs and a dragon. I didn't get any duplicates um, in the bag, which you could. Um, but anyways, I don't know, which one was your favorite? I think that's fun that Claire's online just kind of picks whatever, but you just gotta be aware that you could get duplicates. Um, but I guess it's all right. So thank you guys for joining me on this Squish Mail today. Please make sure to leave a like and subscribe and come back for more Squish Mail and other things. I do lots of other things on this channel too. But I hopefully will see you in the next one. Bye.